What's going on, everybody? SGC reveal. So, um, with everything that happened between me and SGC, uh, with the last order where a card was lost, they refunded me the value of the card, which was awesome. Um, but it took me going up higher to get all this done. It was, and the guy was really embarrassed for the company for the way it was handled, too, I want to add. Yeah, refunding my shipping, grading, all that stuff. And they gave me 10 free grades. So I had some vintage, and there was some stuff in the collection I wanted to get done. And figured, let's have a little fun with this. So this here is a Felix Hernandez Tops Traded. I got a bunch of Beckett slabs that were really, really dinged up. It didn't pay for me really to redo them. Um, so with these free SGC grades, so what the heck, let's get them done. So as you can see, 10, 9, 5, 9, 5, 9, 5. Overall grade, 9, 5. What do you guys think SGC gave it? Oops, we gotta go this way. Came back, 9, 5. Zach grade. Pretty cool. And the other one that we tested, we'll do the Beckett one later. Our Beckett, the PSA one, that's actually in QA2 now. Our Dallas Chapman, it says Bowman Rookie. This is not an autograph. Roman Prospects, quad nine fives onto it, so you guys can see. Came back a 10. Really, really, really happy there. So, good to go. Got to flip my phone off from vibrating. All right, the rest of the order. Some stuff I missed. Like this here, I thought was a nine five. Not too sure what I missed, but came back an eight five. Uh, this is definitely DC Sports Land. I mean, the centering was really good. I didn't see anything on it, but man, after you start looking at stuff, now I can see this corner is a little bit dinged. I don't know what happened to that. I don't know. Might have been me just missing it. Getting into some older stuff. 94 Pri uh, Pacific Prism Emmett Smith came back a 9. Really, really happy on that from 94. I was thinking it was more like an 8.5, possibly, but to get to 9. Boom, like it. Like it when you start seeing this older stuff coming back like that. 95 Fleer Ultra Barry Sanders Gold Medallion. Exactly what I thought it would be an 8. Barry Sanders people Gold Medallion 8. I know, I know, it's not PSA 8, it's not PSA 9, 10, but to find this when you're going through stuff and to be able to get an 8 on, it's pretty, pretty good. I mean, you're still at a near mint. Big Ben Roethlisberger. This is uh, from the rookie year playoff honors rookie tandems. This was Big Ben and uh, Darling. Came back an eight five, half grade higher than what I thought. Figured it would be an eight. So pretty cool piece there. Now we go to more of the vintage that I call it. Eighty one tops Ricky Henderson. I was predicting a four. Came back four and a half. So pretty nice. A little bit down here at that corner is really what really hit it the hardest. Up next, Carlton Fist Tops All-Star Cup rookie. Came back a 5 from 73 tops. Really nice grade onto that. You guys can see a top corner. That's what gets you a 5. All right, what are we talking about? This shocked me. I was predicting 6. Steve Largent rookie, 7.5. This was one of the first football rookies that I end up getting when my dad gave me some of the collection. And um, I got rid of mine long, many, many, many moons ago. And here's another one in return, seven and a half. Probably about the same shape, honestly, as the one that I had. Pretty cool to get that. Last one was the Walter Payton rookie card. You guys know I picked it up at the Louisville Sports Car Show, and I said probably going to be a four. We got a five. This is awesome. It puts it about three to three fifteen for value. Really nice piece. This may end up being your overall winner prize for the Gridiron Football this year. Not too sure. We're still way, way, way away. Different things will be coming in, of course, all throughout. But wanted to share a little quick 10-card SGC with you, give you a little bit of uh, um, fun with, uh, let's see what happened with Beckett versus SGC grading. Pretty much the same, except for they just agreed one was, should be a 10, which 
When you got a bunch of nine and a half, they could float either way across the board onto it. Some of this stuff will end up going to DC Sports. Some of it will be stuck here with me for maybe a short period of time, maybe a long period of time. I never know. But guys, let me know what you guys think. Like I said, it was all free grade. just cost me uh, to ship it there and back onto it. I only had, I think it was a, it was a small time from, I think it was, I can't remember if it was 90 or 180 days to get, uh, the, to use up the free certificates. And I figured, you know, I will, I like to use mostly SGC for vintage, but it's really hard for me to find vintage that I want to grade right now. Cause a lot of it's been graded. Or if you do find out there, you start looking at one or if it's trimmed and et cetera, et cetera. So try a little bit, a little bit of everything different with this order. All right, guys, I am out. Take care. Have a good one. See you all next video.